<laughs> right? And the carny yeah. is snizzle and the short right. for snizz. I mean, right, now right. everybody knows what it is, but that was a way to like talk about it without the agents knowing what the hell we're talking about, right? Right. Even though right. they they probably even though they probably still knew and acted, I don't know. The agents back there were they were, they were such hypocrites, you know. Um, Shit, yeah. But you know, I mean, that's I don't. I mean, I think it's it's probably pretty well documented or known that that was you know when Brian and I were doing our our big tag run that that's why we dropped the belts prior to a year it was like a, a, a couple weeks or something right before we would have been a year long with the tag belts but it was because in Italy uh, we dropped him in Milan but like literally days before that maybe two days before that we were in I think Genova Italy <clears throat> and I had been invited mind you invited by Van Dam and Sabu to go smoke after our matches and we were all done and it was uh it was Fit Finley who came and kind of peeked his leprechaun head over and um you know okay walked away and then it was just like cold to me uh the rest of the the house show and we were usually pretty cordial but he was just just kind of passive aggressive and, and i asked him i was like is there like a problem fit like is there some issue like have i done something that's pissed you off no 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 it was like i thought this was <laughs> i thought this was the guy that liked to fight um <clears throat> he certainly wasn't uh he certainly wasn't showing that at that moment when i was literally trying to squash the issue whatever was up his ass <clears throat> but um but then, yeah, the next day or whatever, when we were at SmackDown, it was like, oh, we know we told you guys we were going to go a year with these belts, but we think it's about time. We we haven't had a title switch. It's funny you mentioned Santino because it was like they said, it's you know, we haven't had a title switch in this building in years. When, mind you, like the day before, Santino had just beat Umaga for the belt. So they had just done a title switch in the <laughs> same building the right. day before. But that was the excuse they gave us. <clears throat> we haven't done a title switch in this building in quite some time. You know, it's probably been, uh, wow, I mean, 20, 24 hours. <laughs> 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 so, you know, that just <clears throat> that just goes to show you, like, a lot of the, the cowardice and uh, kind of hypocrisy. And then later I had found out that, you know, <clears throat> I had heat for that because – I hadn't like I hadn't earned that right to go smoke with these guys. Mind you, they had just they had invited me and they were friends of mine. You know, Van Dams who introduced me to the whole thing, you know, like years before, which was, you know, a badge of honor for me because I grew up a Van Dam fan and then, oh, yeah. you know, um to get invited to go smoke with him like when I had never done anything uh was pretty cool <laughs> i always liken it to being taught how to sing by elvis right um yeah i was like yeah elvis was my singing teacher <laughs> like yeah rob introduced me to to the marijuana culture and how to smoke and how to do all that and stuff uh but you know i think you were on one side of the fence or the other like you were either <clears throat> you hung out with that that group that the office frowned upon or you were one of the like you were one of the kiss ass clones that you know did everything that was asked of them would still get punished because you know they made scapegoats at everybody but it was uh it was a time when you you noticed a lot of ass kissing i mean i'm sure the business has not changed there's still ass kissers everywhere but you'd see that it, it wouldn't get anyone anywhere you know, to see these guys kissing ass and then they would get fired like a week or two later. And it's like, yeah, how's it feel now? You know, like, are you glad you like, had that lipstick? <laughs> oh, that's just one example of many, you know what I mean? But 